is. Uh, I'll stop peeing outside the coronation gardens and I'm around. So the front is a 17 um, uh, Volvo B8 Armalene with a light eclipse of a Bordain working at 17 to Stanbridge.
into Wilder's room it used to be known as the 246.
2021, uh, the Green Boss uh, pulled off the 242 and uh, was taken over by select bus services. And then the council, Staffordshire Council, who actually paid for the 242, then changed the timetable. Uh, instead of going like 10 to on the hour, it went to 10 past the hour. And then it resumed back to 10 to on the hour, 10 to the hour, sorry. And uh, was then replaced. And then, uh, and then instead of going through the junction station, uh, it now goes around the high period. So, and of course, they also introduced the school service, the 242S, that goes by a high, via half penny green, because before it was the 742 that was introduced here. And uh, to the left of me used to be the size of the old Hartsell bus garage. So then guys, here we go. On the uh, number 6 route uh, from uh, Dudley to Stour Bridge. And uh, we're now at Hartsill, just by the old Hartsill bus garage. And uh, we are now going past the Lidl, uh, not Lidl, Aldi and uh, Wicks and even Keiko. Now Keiko used to be B&M Bargains and way before that it used to be occupied uh, by um, Fabric Ware, the Fabric Warehouse. And we're also by the Dreams Bed Store. And uh, the bus we have is a double decker, an IDL Enviro 400, fleet numbered 4762, with a registration being BV57 XKF. Now, this bus was new to Yardley Wood Garage in 2008, uh, transferred to West Bromwich uh, in 2015, and then transferred over to Pensnet five years later in 2020. And uh, if you remembered, uh, Pensnet used to have the ALX 400s, the Dennis Tridents. But however, the Dennis Tridents uh, are seen now over at Wolverhampton Garage. Uh, because obviously the Trident ALX 400s were getting old and these buses, I think these were the buses that replaced the Tridents at Pensnet Bus Garage. And they even had the Red Crimson Crimson ADL Enviro 400s, MMCs, but they've gone over to Acox Green Garage. And uh, this bus carries the new National Express West Midlands livery. Uh, the same colour as the Platinums. And as well as it being on the 6 here at Pensnet, it also does other routes, sort like the 2s occasionally and the 2A. It does the 126. Sometimes it goes on to the 9s and the X10, which are Platinums. Also, they make appearance on the uh, 7s. Uh, so, all the routes that are deck, uh, double deck friendly at Pensnet, they'll be able to go on. So, anyway, we're now going through Brawley Alloy Street. And uh, 4762, when it was over at West Bromwich, it was on the 80 corridor. Along with the 87, the 74, and uh, when it started at Yardley Wood, it was a, it was uh, branded for the 50 route, and the colour scheme branding was just similar to um, the 74 branding, and also it had the grey colour before, and it also was on the 18 from Yardley Wood Garage as well towards uh, Maypole. Uh, not my part, I think it towards Northfield and Bartley Green. I'm not sure if it was Northfield, uh, but comment below. And uh, so, anyway, here we go. We're now on our way down towards Stower Bridge. So, we're now on our way to Stower Bridge. And, uh, and the 6 uh, used to be known as the 246. And if you remember, the 246 was a good uh, Travel West Midlands route. And, of course, it will nearly be six years since the changes from the three-digit numbers to one or two. And uh, so the six uh, uh, originated as the 246. The 276 became the seven. 
The X96 became the 8, but in 2020, the 8 was rerouted to Wolverhampton. The 140 uh, was extended to Wolverhampton uh, as the X8. The 126 was shortened to Dudley only. And, of course, the 129 was shortened to become the 13B, but the 13B no longer exists. And uh, the 127 was shortened to uh, Blackheath only, uh, number the 13A. So, uh, the 246, um, which is now the 6, uh, the buses that you'll find on here is ADL Enviro 400. Sometimes ADL Enviro 200s come on this route. And when there's a short of double-decker vehicles, the B7s uh, make the appearance on the route. And uh, this route was also operated by GRS Travel, which was a small independent company. And um, so it was a small, so a small independent company used to follow the NX uh, 246. And they used the old uh, Dennis Dart buses, if you remember GRS. Uh, it was a small independent operator. And they operated the route 246 in 2014. And... Um, but however, that didn't last very long. That soon, that soon came to an end. And of course, if you remembered, Travel West Midlands used the B10 Right Light Liberators on this route, and the Metro buses made appearance. And if you remember, the Street Decks used to come on this route, and the Optair XLs. So there were loads of good buses on this route back in the day. And uh, now it's just all the modern buses that come on this route. And uh, so there's been a lot of changes in vehicles over the years. And if you remember the 311 and the 313. Uh, so the 311. So the 311 to Stalbridge, if you remember that. And uh, they used uh, Scania Omnilinks. If you remembered, Scania Omnilinks used to come down to Stalbridge. Uh, but when Diamond had the Scanias for a bit at Kidderminster, they used them. And they had the Mark 1 B7s that were actually branded for the 311 and the 311A. And you had the 313 as well. Not sure if the 313 went to Stourbridge, but I know the 311 did. So anyway, here we go. We're continuing on our journey on the 6 uh, down to Stourbridge.
Right then, here we go. We're now on our way into uh, Stalbridge on the number six. And uh, once we've done the six, that will then complete our journey. So I hope you've so I hope you've enjoyed my exciting videos it's on this YouTube channel, Jersey Bus Train Plane Lift Adventures, and we will continue with more and more exciting vlogs in the next upcoming days, weeks and months. Uh, might do a couple of virtual but I'm not sure yet. So anyway we're by Laser Quest. So there are some changes happening very soon so I'm going to let you know when the changes will come to effect. Uh, unfortunately we couldn't do you Toxita because of obvious reasons, unforeseen circumstances. Uh, but however we are going to do some exciting videos uh, real soon and I have so I have got the 101 Telford to um, so I've got the 101 on the list uh, that will come up real soon so I'll let you know when I'll do the 101 uh, which is the uh, the May which is the Wellington to Maidley uh, well Maidley Wellington to Maidley from the Princess Royal Hospital too and uh, so here we go we're on our way towards um, Stalbridge and the service will terminate at Stalbridge Interchange so once we get to Stalbridge that will be the completion of the number six in, and it's been a while since I've last been on the six because I haven't done this route uh, since 2023 uh, well 2022 I've I last been on this route so it's it's really interesting to see me back on the six because I haven't been on this route for a while uh, it's nice for me to come back on this nice for me to have a ride on the six and uh, as you know uh, before I went on the six I was on the 14A uh, from Merry Hill and uh, the next route uh, well won't be a video uh, I went for a travel on the 242 service over to Kimva and then did the 25 service uh, back to Mary Hill. And uh, so here we go, we're now on our way into the town of Stourbridge. So we're just at the traffic lights uh, by uh, Amblecote Church, uh, just also by Corbett Hospital um, area as well. So here we go, we're now on our way to uh, Stourbridge where this service will terminate so we'll be terminating at Stourbridge interchange and uh, when this route gets to Stourbridge you've got connections to various different destinations the 318 to Bromsgrove the 242 to Kimva the 125 to Kidderminster and Bridge North also including Bewley of course you've got the 57 to Woolleaf 17s to Dudley via Woolleaf uh, eights to Wolverhampton via Merry Hill, 16 to Wolverhampton, sevens to Dudley via the Merry Hill, also including Lai, nines to Birmingham, 142 to Halsarin and Merry Hill, and of course the 142A. And of course you've got the 25 to Dudley via Merry Hill and Neverton, so there are different routes to choose from to go between Stourbridge and Dudley, so you haven't just got this one. And also you've got the 88 that goes round the Norton Estate as well. And also Pedmore. So we have got variety of different routes to choose from within the Starbridge area. Because before you used to have the uh, 298, 299 and also the 250, 251, the 10A and 10C. The 10A and 10C is what is now today's 88 route. And uh, the 88 uh, was actually, a it was also the old 288, which actually follows the same route, what, uh, well it actually followed the same route what the 88 does today. The only change is it's just the two numbers. And uh, so anyway, here we go. Now coming into Stourbridge by the Bonding Warehouse. So this is going to be the end of the journey. 
I'd like to say thank you very much for watching this YouTube channel, Jers Plus Train Plane Lift Adventures. Shout out to Black Country Traveller. Uh, keep watching my videos and uh, hope you do more and more exciting videos for me so I can enjoy watching. Uh, them, uh, and I'll be really happy to be watching more of your exciting videos. Anyway, coming up now is the Costa Coffee, uh, the KFC and the McDonald's. KFC used to be at the bottom of Brittle Lane, while McDonald's used to be in the town centre of Stourbridge. And uh, here's the BP petrol station on the left hand side, and on the right hand side is B&M, which used to be known as Wilkinson's. If you remembered, Wilkinson's used to be here in Stourbridge until the company collapsed last year and here's the Mercedes garage which used to be the old Midland Red garage so here we are welcome to Stourbridge thank you very much for watching take care guys see you all soon for more and more exciting vlogs that will be here on Joe's bus train plane lift adventures so just laying over is a street light a diamond bus uh, working for the 25 service over to Dudley so here we go, we're now arriving at Stalbridge Interchange, the final destination on this service. So the 6 terminates here, so all change please, this bus now terminates here, all change. So here we go, our bus is now heading on to the far stand where the 6 will then depart back to Dudley.